divide x power 5 minus 1 by x minus 1. While dividing polynomials, first we write it in this way. x power 5 minus 1 is dividend, we write here. By x minus 1 is the divisor, we write here. Now, here it is x power 5, below this also I should get x power 5. Here I have x power 1. This should be multiplied with what? To get x power 5. This should be multiplied with x power 4. To get x power 5. When you are multiplying to this x power 1, this should also multiply to the other term that is minus 1. So x power 4 into minus 1 will be minus x power 4. Here I do not have x power 4 term, so I write it separately. Okay, now this becomes your first term of the quotient. Okay, now change the signs. Here it is plus, make it minus. Here it is minus, make it plus. Now this cancel out. Now don't write minus 1 first. We write in the decreasing powers of x. So here it is plus x power 4. That I write first, then minus 1. Okay. Now, here it is x power 4. Below this also I should get x power 4. Here I have x power 1. That should be multiplied with x power 3 to get x power 4. When I am multiplying to this term, I should also multiply to the other term that is minus 1. So x cube minus 1 will be minus x cube. Here I do not have x cube term, so I have written separately. Now, this is your second term of the quotient. So plus x cube. Now change the signs. Here it is plus, make it minus. Here it is minus, make it plus. Now this cancel out. Do not write minus 1 first. We write in the decreasing powers of x. So here it is plus x cube minus 1. Now here it is x cube. So below this also you should also get x cube. Here you have x power 1 x power 1 should be multiplied with x power 2 to get x cube. When x power 2 you are multiplying to this term, this should also be multiplied to the second term that is minus 1. So x square into minus 1 is minus x square. Here I do not have minus x square so I write it separately. Now this becomes your next term of the quotient that is here plus x square. Now change the signs. Here it is plus make it minus here it is minus make it plus. So now this cancel out. Do not write minus 1 first. We write in the decreasing powers of x in whatever remaining. So x power 2 first and minus 1 after that. Now here x power 2, below this also I should get x power 2. Here I have x. Here I should get x power 2. That could only happen if I multiply this with x. So x when I am multiplying to this, I should also multiply to the other term that is minus 1. So x into minus 1 is minus x. Here I don't have x term so I write it separately. Now, this is another term of your quotient you write here, plus x. Okay. Now, change the signs. Here it is plus, make it minus. Here it is minus, make it plus. So, now this cancel out. Do not write minus 1. First, write the x term. x minus 1. Now here you have 
x below this also you should get x here you have x here also you have x so this should be multiplied with 1 to get x so when you are multiplying to this you should also multiply to the other term that is minus 1 so 1 into minus 1 is minus 1 now this becomes your another term of the quotient so you write in the quotient plus 1 now you change the signs here it is plus make it minus so this cancel out here it is minus make it plus it cancel out we get 0 so this is the reminder and this is our quotient am i clear <laughs>